there is no such thing as a simple cellular upgrade. Uh, nothing is as simple as it seems whenever it comes to consumer technology. Yeah, that's right. New phones can be pricey, so a lot of people yeah. just hang on to their old phones as long as they can. But some of those old smartphones won't be working soon. Yeah, neither will a bunch of other devices, like even some home security systems. Jason Barry explains why and what you can do about it. There are cell towers like this one all over town. They help control our phones, cars, even home security. But soon, our older devices will stop working when mobile providers shut down their 3G networks. Technology moves pretty fast, so it's important to keep up. All major cellular carriers are planning to shut down their 3G networks this year, starting with AT&T next week. Any older phone, tablet, or other device that connects through 3G only will become almost useless. Let's see if we can help uh, Katie. Consumer tech expert Kim Commando hosts a nationally syndicated radio show where she's been warning listeners for months about the need to upgrade their devices. We've known about this 3G ending for many years, but procrastination is key among us, right? We keep wanting to put it off, put it off. But I've actually been talking about it on air for about a year and a half now. The 3G shutdown will not only impact phones and tablets, it will also affect navigation systems and remote locks and vehicles that are a few years old. Medical alerts will also be affected, so will home security systems. We have our cameras set up here. Tim Harvey is sales manager with Titan Alarm in Phoenix. He recommends anyone with a home or business security system that's more than a year old check and see whether they need an upgrade because if it's still on 3G and 3G shuts down, the alarm may keep working, but police and fire won't be notified if there is an emergency and nobody will come out. Once that sun sets, your system will still work normally. It just won't communicate. So if you have an alarm, if you have a trouble, nobody's ever gonna know because none of that communication is gonna go out to our monitoring stations. AT&T is planning to stop its 3G service on Tuesday, February 22nd. T-Mobile will do the same March 31st. Verizon will finish shutting down its 3G network by the end of the year. When we have something that works, we have a tendency, that whole thing, if it's not broke, why fix it? So 3G has been working fine, so why did I need to worry about it? Well, now the deadline is here, and now you do need to worry about it. The best thing you can do if you're not sure whether your device needs to be upgraded is contact the company that sold it to you or the business that installed it. In Phoenix, Jason Berry for Arizona's Family.